Hey guys, welcome to my new house. My last one was just a little bit too flammable for my taste, so look at this, look at this right here. In this project, I'm gonna show you in depth kind of how to take apart an N64. And this is the piece you're looking for. The hard part isn't really gonna be turning this into an N64, it's gonna be turning this into a cardboard controller. It's doable. Thankfully, we won't be lacking materials today. I can just like rip off the wall if I need to. I'll right off the bat address one of the first concerns that people have anytime I make a cardboard console, and that's the cooling. People are always worrying that the console is either going to catch fire by overheating, or if it gets wet that it's going to be trashed. But people don't realize I'm not just I'm not doing this to like sell it as a product. I'm not looking to like avoid getting sued. The point is, cardboard video game console. That's outrageous. People see that and they're like, what? That is crazy. If I made this safe, would it be the least bit interesting? People watch me for the danger, for the suspense. Also, if your house is anything like mine, you can simply use any scraps uh, for patching up holes in the walls, making a little outlet cover, even just extra tiling on the kitchen floor. Look at this, look at this here. Are you looking? Guy, guys, are you looking? Every YouTuber puts all kinds of effort into bright colors and fast talking and hey guys, look at this. Hey guys, this is crazy. Isn't this crazy guys? Are you paying attention? Why are we not at a point where we just quite frankly demand that people pay attention? Hey, look at this. Look at, look, just pay attention. Song that is stuck in my head update. Currently, I have the Adventure Time theme song stuck in my head. Please note specifically the version on YouTube of the guy who plays it on his ukulele and then throws up everywhere. Think about that video though. Every time I make a new friend, which sounds really cringe, I make a note to show them that because I just think it's so funny. And I think showing someone a picture of someone unexpectedly vomiting everywhere is a good way to get a gauge on what kind of a person they are, what, what sort of sense of humor they have. There is a fly in here. It's been bothering me for weeks. He feeds off the cardboard. He's up there right now. Right there. <laughs> uh, that means I got him. Okay, fair enough. This fly swatter is made of cardboard, by the way. This is actually a very special project to me personally. Some of you might remember a few years ago, if you happen to have been in my house in, in 2012, that I actually made a cardboard N64 many, many years ago. I've been known to get all the ladies because of that event. Let's pop these in here. Look at this, look at this. Look, 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 look. We're just gonna wrap this around the rest of it at about that height. You gotta make sure you're cutting along a certain grain so that if you're trying to bend it, Curve of curvedly like this, that you've got these little ripples in the cardboard, not cutting this way, but cutting this way. And that's a little tip that I taught myself when I was my age. Reinforce this with a nice little soldering, solder, some of the inside too, just because we're not making this like extremely, extremely functional and actually not ventilated at all does not mean that you can't make it well built. YouTube requires that if I title a video Cardboard N64, that I at least do make a Cardboard Nintendo 64. That is not a joke. Technically, misleading titles and thumbnails are against terms of service, although I can't say anyone has ever been punished for that. Just gotta always make sure you're following the YouTube rules. Now again, I'll add this disclaimer. Unless breaking the YouTube rules allows you to follow them more thoroughly, then it would be okay for you to break those rules. And I don't want anyone to refute me on that because I know it's true for a fact. Now, I don't have the original heatsink for this N64 on me, but to stay true to the actual style, not because I care about heating and cooling, we are gonna put this cardboard heatsink on here. I'm kidding, I'm joking. Oh my gosh, you guys are no fun. All of you, every single one of you, even the ones who, who really wants this to explode in flames and is rooting for me. I'm sorry, I shouldn't, shouldn't put blame on those who it does not apply to. Unless of course I should, in which case then I will. Am I, am I an accurate YouTuber yet? Have I satisfied everyone's moral needs and covered every single base?
I should sell these shells on Etsy. I'm not doing this to like sell I'm not doing this to like, like I cannot believe I just said sell these shells without mispronouncing that. People are right, I really have changed. Cut this little slot out for the AV cable. This just randomly happens to fit perfectly. Someone's rooting for me. Someone, someone up top likes my YouTube channel, guys. I'm telling you. Look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. Looking, are you looking? Look at this, hold on. Wait, look, I make a hole for the cartridge. Kissed your ears better. You're just so very, very welcome in every little itsy bitsy cutesy wootsy way. All right, putting the faceplate on this thing. That's what that's called. No, this isn't in fast forward. I'm just this quick. Okay, did not place that perfectly. This is perfectly fine. They used to call me Dick, like the name, contradict, contradict, <laughs> contra, make it look all good and presentable. Some people think I don't care, I care. And then some people wonder why I care. They're like, you're making a cardboard video game console, why do you care? And I always tell them, oh, I care. And they're like, that doesn't answer my question. Now we're gonna wanna take our heat sink here. Get a look at this, check this out. You want to throw this all across here. Burn yourself, because you deserve it. You've been bad. We all have. Slightly curve it as it dries. Just get this whole thing secured. Now the last step is to declare it done before immediately remembering you forgot to put the power and reset buttons. Mark some holes where it's entirely possible they could be. Tell them never to text me again. And then send them a funny picture of Sonic, because that would make them happy. Trap this in there because it'll be lost forever. Oh, did your butthole pucker there too? Un unask, unsay. If you drink a cold drink when you're blowing on something to cool it down, it makes your breath colder. I didn't learn this until I was like 23, so a lot of you guys are gonna have a little step up in life. I'll lather that, paste this dude. It's just that easy. Oh no! Hmm. And of course, don't forget to cut the logo. I'm, I'm saying that for the, the YouTube short. That will obviously get made about this. Oh, I should do that, I should do that again, actually. And then first, and then, and then, let me do that again. And then you need to do the logo, then the logo, then do the logo. Forgot how to draw six for a second there. Pop that bad boy on there. It's too easy, man. Nintendo didn't know you would be this easy. It's too easy. Oh, but Peter, you really didn't make a cardboard N64 because the insides aren't made of cardboard and the cables aren't made of cardboard. I'm fully committed to this idea. I'm watching this on my cardboard phone with my cardboard internet wearing my cardboard underwear. With the console done and looking pretty snazzy, we move on to the hardest part, the controller. After a brief rest and letting this fan run because it's extremely hot in here. Yes, this fan is made of 100% cardboard, completely runs off cardboard. Don't worry guys, I'm a man of integrity. I had to manufacture these cameras out of cardboard just for this video. Even my text notification today is made out of cardboard. Don't worry guys, I am holding true to my morals. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna take a cardboard crap. Transition, I am back. What the heck is in your mouth? It's a very uninteresting part of the video, so you can keep an eye on that guy. Uh, pretend like the background is in the whole house is cardboard. Uh, if you're still bored and you just want some more comedy, triplets born and Koopas. I got a little sidetrack and made a dog treat for Dingus. He loves it. He's, oh, it's so tasty. Now, hopefully this is simple inside. Oh, yeah, it's pretty simple, actually. Now, I do think, despite popular belief, I do think, 
dump my, dump my dog in the ocean. He was looking at you. He noticed you. You should be thankful. Nice. Now I know there's a lot of people in the audience who hate my dog a lot, and rightfully so. I can't say he's had the smartest opinions over the years, and he really has no regard for, for my happiness. He's not the greatest employee to work with. And now he's eating cardboard because uh, he's lacking several different brain cells. I choose to have him here because I can decide who I want to be friends with and who I want to associate with. Popma. Hey, what do you have? What are you eating? Huh? He decided that this was really tasty. I've decided it was a bad idea to let him in this room. There's trick-or-treaters outside, and he's gonna have a panic attack if he has to interact with people. He's very socially awkward in that regard. Start button. Oh, cringe. Peter, you're stupid. Scoop, scoop, doo, dee, doo, dee, doo, dee, doo. Could do a very rudimentary, crude job of this. I know there's a lot of different religions and races that tune in. So all, to all those ones who are religiously against me putting the hot glue on the stuff, you may want to just like close your eyes a little bit and just like do one of these. Just be like, disavow. You can do a little disavow, okay? And that was my impression of Sonic dying. Ah! So we're gonna do some cable management. Hey, decent tree. In my video, if the start butt doesn't work, that's not the biggest thing. Did I say start butt? What is what is start butt? Snip a little hole for the cord to stick through here, just like that. This some of that that secret cardboard tech. Our button's gonna be mounted right here, but as you can see when you push it, this whole thing moves. So we gotta reinforce this ever so slightly. You might ask how you're gonna do that. You have forgotten that all problems end in hot glue as the solution. You've not been paying attention to this video, you've not been paying attention to any of my videos, nor my entire channel. I'm feeling neglected and sad. He's now passed out on the floor because he was drinking too much. I'm just thinking of things to make this part interesting because we're just waiting for hot glue to dry. I feel like I'm doing decent. I'm not doing bad. It's not good. Just pretend like I'm giving some really interesting commentary here with a little bit of jokes mixed in. Koopa. Photo your shop here if you want me to like look like I'm giving you a kiss. I really hope you didn't just interrupt a montage. Oh my gosh. This has no business working. See, if you cut something, it doesn't quite fit. Scribble on it, cut it again. Everyone's heard the saying. Measure cut twice once. Huh? More like cut as many times as you- The choke's gone, Peter. You messed it up. Let it go. It died five seconds ago. The accident was your fault. Doing all the gluing in one go, which is extremely a bad idea. Oh, Peter! Why am I gonna put it on my balloon? Ah, my knee! I- Okay. Where am I gonna put my memory card? How am I gonna load my save game? It's made of cardboard. Critique me. Critique my project. Critique my video. You cannot. And lastly, oh, it's doing it again. Okay. Ah. Sometimes you gotta spank yourself when you're bad. <laughs> I like that one. Imagine if kids operated like that, I wouldn't have to do anything. I have so many kids, guys. I have to spank them all the time all my kids that I have. For aesthetics, we're going to make this cardboard as well. <sighs> yeah, my back hurt. Becky hurty. 
And there we go. Cardboard plug, cardboard controller, and it feels just as comfortable as a regular N64 controller. Is that a testament to my skill or a slam against N64? In my opinion, music should be interpretive and there's no answer to that. So well, let's, well, wallets, 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 give me your wallets. Use your words, calm yourself, you're excited. Relax, speak clearly. Now that we have the N64 controller and the N64, we will now test them. I will bring the TV down here. Okay. Oh, good thing this is a strong cardboard table. I even got myself a cardboard gaming chair. Mmm. This video has been sponsored by pain and suffering. If we open Lightning's mouth here, yeah, we can actually plug this in the front. Kind of a cool feature. Samsung, you know, you have some pretty impressive TVs. Um, none of them can you plug things into the front. In fact, you don't even support these anymore. Kind of lame, honestly. Big L for Samsung there. Do, 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 do. do one of these. And we're playing this because it has a Clefairy minigame. All the Clefairies are cardboard, so it's kind of fitting. Oh, that's good sound. I like that. Oh, yeah. Do I ever miss that? There he is! <laughs> oh, he's kind of cute. Good thing I have him here. This is his nice little teeth. All right. Ah, let's get comfy. Lightning, you gotta put it in reverse, dude. It's way too loud. Oh, I forgot volume up also changes the input sometimes. Heck, back again. Okay, go back again. I'd be very surprised if the start button worked. You can play mini games here. New Pokemon, hope you'll join them for fun. New Pokemon, they were all waiting for me. That's me. I'm the baby Pikachu. Diglett keeps moving even when the control stick is untouched. Push those buttons. Just like, is this life advice? What is this referring to? Oh, this one doesn't have the Skull Clefairy minigame. It has Egg Emergency and st Streaming Stampede. Pretty much just a Twitch raid, I think. Okay, I gotta get the, I gotta get the other one. He's popping Oh, thank you. You can just essentially do this. So that's what those screws are for. And and the power button worked. Ow! Put it in reverse, tear. Oh, new Pokemon waiting for me. Who's the best? Me. Don't need to choose that one. I know exactly what I'm doing. Get me with that. Catch me with that hard Clefairy stuff, buddy. I got it. Clefairy says. Hopefully she doesn't say a bunch of offensive terms on Twitter. I'm very hip and modern. Okay. Get bonked, horny jail idiots. Okay, Uncle Fairy's dead. School prison for being an idiot. I may completely suck at that. I might. I, I, you know, I was pretty good for the most part, but whatever. Yeah, sure, I lost. This is, stats speak for themselves. And you may have caught me committing domestic abuse on live on Twitter, but I'm the one playing my cardboard Nintendo 64 on Halloween, and you're not. And you know what else? I bet you don't own this. I bet you don't even have one of these. This is a Hot Wheels boombox? Hold on. And it's a great day for racing. Gentlemen, start your engine. That and was, he takes the checkered flag! That was on minimum volume, by the way. Stop! And it's a great day for racing! Gentlemen! Stop! Start your engine! Stop! 
Stop. Imagine trying to use this thing and mom and dad are sleeping. That's all it does, but it's not a radio or a CD player or anything. It just plays those sounds. I fall asleep to it a lot. Oh, there's supposed to be like a creepy pasta edge to this for spooky day. Ooh. Pasta. <laughs> Government has spent over $10 billion last year creating fake birds that inject our grass with poison.